Yo, what's up guys and stop don't click off the video. Let me say this my last video on how to get the the new oath Was actually wrong. Okay, so I missed out a couple of things and I found out the exact Requirement to get this new oath also if you're wondering why this brain sucker is not going this guy I think someone crashed the server. It's pretty cool. So I decided to record her. But anyways, this is a brand new account I am level 9 and I'm gonna show you guys how to actually get the oath and this is the exact requirement now before I do, please subscribe, and if you do, I will mail a puppy to your house. Or, if you don't like puppies, I'll mail a kitty to your house. Alright, subscribe, and let's get right into it. Just, of course, talk to this NPC, to ask him about the ship, and then, let's just do trial 1 real quick, and get 40 strength, 40 agility, and also 75 of any weapon. Alright guys, so I just did trial 1, and I have 40 strength, 39 agility, and you're gonna see why I have 39 agility right now, and 75 medium. Alright. Alright, what I'm gonna do is before I even go to the ship, I'm gonna reset to videos and I'm gonna have my friend who is Max Frostraw. By the way, it doesn't have to be just Frostraw, it can be literally any attunement, including Shadow. And I'm gonna have him grip me while using mantras to actually knock me. So, a lot of people seem to think that, oh, to actually get the thing, you need to talk to the shrine first, and then you need to get gripped, and then you have to go back to him. And that's just pr very tedious. So, to make it easier for yourself, let's just do the tedious part out of the way first. By the way, if you do not get gripped by a two-minute player, what I was going to say is, oh, you need some vengeance, or you lack purpose because you've never gotten gripped by a two-minute player before, so you don't hate the two-minute players. I'm just going to get gripped by a two-minute user, so just use your mantras on me. Just uh, knock me with your mantras. There we go. And you can grip me now. So now, this will progress you through the oh you need vengeance or you need like some sort of revenge so now we just have to go to the shrine again and for those of you who don't know where the shrine is i'm just gonna do a quick time lapse of where you want to go to actually go to the shrine and you're starting off from ministry set docks all right we're here at the ship and now, once you got gripped, you just want to talk to the ghosts, of course. Let me just get up here real quick. Alright, let me see if there's a ghost in the server. Yep, there it is, so I'm going to talk to you. Uh, there we go. Just kill them real quick. Well, not actually kill them, they're ghosts, they can't die. I mean, you can knock them, but you know what I mean, they're going to disappear. Alright, now go to the shrine. And look, he's going to say, because I got gripped by a attunement user, right? He's going to say, you lack the aptitude to carry out your revenge. Basically, you lack the requirements to carry out your revenge. Now, let's take a look at my stats. 75 medium. I did not uncap my medium. Now, you do not need specifically medium for this. It could be literally anything. It could be light, medium, or heavy. Just 75 of it. Okay? And now, I know you guys will say, bro, I saw some guy get it at 25 agility. Well, I'm about to prove you wrong because look at this, right? So I have 40 strength, 39 Jody. When I talk to him, he says I lack the aptitude. And if I didn't get gripped by a element user, he would have said, oh, I lack the revenge or purpose. So just make sure you get gripped by element user. Also, I should note that you don't have to actually go back to the NPC. You only need, you only need to talk to the NPC and the, do the ghost to actually spawn the, the shrine. All right. So after this, now look at this. Put on the ankle weights. One a Jody. I now have 40 a Jody, 40 strength. And bam, your soul. We can sense its putrid aura. The stench of revenge clouds your very being, suffocating all desires. You wish for redemption. We can help you. What are you? Broken. A, hus a husk of what's what was. We can just skip through this. And I shall take your oath. What must I do next? And bam. Oath. Silent heart. Okay? Now, this should put to the rest, though. Oh, oh. To get this oath, you need 40 strength only. Or, you only need 40 strength and 25 agility. That's not true! Now, I do find it weird that some guy got it with 25 agility. But what I think happened is, I think this is basically like neuroplasticity. To get neuroplasticity, you need 35 in either willpower, charisma, or intelligence. So, when you get that, you now can roll neuroplasticity. So, how I think this oath works is, I think you need 40 into 2 core attributes and then 75 into any media, into any weapon stat. So if I had like 40 strength and 40 intelligence, um, I could probably get it. However, this is just my theory. 
this is not confirmed. So if you really want the oath, just go 40 strength and 40 agility and you will guaranteed get it, okay? Alright guys, now if you subscribe, I will mail this kitty or if you don't like kitties, this puppy to your house. So subscribe and they will be in your door in 3-5 to five business days. Thank you guys so much for watching and bye bye.